the latest drama in Trump news. Trump made an agreement with Mexico in regards to asylum, you know, holding the caravan there for asylum in Mexico. But after Trump's threat, Mexico said, this bitch is off. <laughs> November 25th, 2018. A day after news broke that the U.S. and Mexico had reached a new agreement on asylum seekers, Mexican officials announced that the deal was off. The agreement initially reported by the Washington Post would have seen asylum seekers remain in Mexico rather than the U.S. While their applications were processed, as Think Progress, Melanie Smith wrote, the deal breaks with longstanding asylum rules and will stymie the process of the large caravan of migrants from Central America, currently making its way to the U.S. southern border, fleeing poverty and gang violence. Those seeking refuge will now be forced to wait in Mexico border states where cartel violence is rampant. Wow. Went from one violent place to another. The Remain in Mexico deal was apparently struck between the Trump administration and incoming Mexican President Andres Manuel Lopez. Okay, whatever. Um, who begins his term next week on Twitter? Donald Trump praised the deal, writing the asylum seekers will stay in Mexico. Trump when threatened to close the border entirely if it becomes necessary. And this is Trump's tweet. Migrants at the southern border will not be allowed into the United States until their claims are individually approved in court. We only will allow those who come into our country legally. Other than that, our very strong policy is catch and detain. No release into the U.S. Then he wrote another tweet. All will stay in Mexico. If for any reason it becomes necessary, we will close our southern border. There is no way that the United States will, after decades of abuse, put up with this costly and dangerous situation anymore. But on Sunday, the AP reported that Mexican affix, uh, officials said the deal was off. <laughs> oh, boy. and may never have existed in the first place. In a statement, Mexican Interior Minister Olga Sanchez said there was no agreement of any sort between the incoming Mexican government and the United States government. The announcement conflicts with her previous statement, which indicated an agreement Sanchez has not explained the discrepancy. The deal's apparent collapse is the last blow to those pursuing asylum in the U.S. Thousands of asylum seekers, mainly from Central America, have clustered into northern Mexico and have recently become targets of anti-immigrant sentiments not only in the U.S., but in Mexico as well. Locals have harassed migrants and local officials have refused to use taxpayer funds in order to ease the migrant struggles. 
Now they'll have to wait even longer to figure out their next steps, even as Trump threatens to close the border entirely. <laughs> so, so there you go. Trump is talking about a deal that Mexico says does not exist. So they will not be keeping these people in Mexico when they reach the border. Mexico, as far as they're concerned, they can go right across the border into the U.S. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.